So it's uh, Tuesday, April 30th, 2024. So I had an appointment this morning with the uh, tax assessor to talk about the new evaluation on my property. I was asking him, uh, did somebody put gold shutters on my house because I couldn't understand why my value had doubled in six years. So fortunately I had gone and get a couple assessments done on my property and I had a little ammunition on my side to show that the guy didn't know what he was talking about. But sometimes you got to take them to court to win and if I have to do that, oh hey, might be worth the money just to file. Sometimes as soon as you file they just give in because they don't want to go to court on it. So look at that action baby. Connie ain't going to be falling out of the lock. Unlock. Open. Connie ain't going to fall out of the truck anymore. Nah, I'm just joking. But the door did open up two times coming out of the market over the last uh, few months. When I go driving off, the door opened up on her. And she, because you had to like pull the handle back, it was sticking underneath the panel. So I got that side turned around. And this side is... Uh, going to go back together again. These panels, I don't know if I told you guys, I was going down the road and uh, there was a leather couch sitting on the side of the road waiting for the trash guys to pick them up. And I grabbed it, cut the leather off it. I left the rest of the chair there. I just cut all the leather off it and left the rest of the chair there. People were driving by looking at me like, what's wrong with this idiot? So you can see what I did basically was just turn this over and shortened it up because this dragging on here with the panel was causing an issue. Put this panel back on and then I'll be good to go. So I've been driving the 36 now everywhere I go. Uh, I went out this morning. Six o'clock, I went to Walmart. I like to go real early. They open at six, so that's when I go. There's hardly anybody there. And uh, getting little things like, and yeah, I know I painted the chrome and I didn't really sand it down that much, but I'm going to be getting my touch up paint out here and uh, touching some of that stuff up. But the patina and everything, where I tried to make it look like patina where the joints are. It's all patina paint. It's all looking good. Running boards are looking good. Patina up here. Just starting to get a little rust through on the hood. Sometimes when I do these patina paint jobs, it's like they get better with age, you know? It's, uh, they start to blend more together. But she's running good. I take it up the road. So uh, once I get the 48 finished, I got to do some work on the house. Cause it rained, I can't paint, but I can't start to fix a couple of the crappy shingles on the other side. Once I get done working on the house, maybe later this afternoon, I'll turn this around and put it in front of the garage with this side pointing towards the door. And I'll start countersinking all of those and get the screws in on this side. I've been changing up a little bit on what I'm thinking. And I tell you guys I might put this on the tailgate. And I'm now thinking that maybe I want to do these in red. And uh, maybe a red pinstripe. So I'll have red, white, and blue. And then I can make it on the door American service station. American by Amico. That's what I'm thinking. Red, white, and blue. And then put Amico on the door. Kind of similar to what I did with the golf truck. I don't know. Just what's coming to my head now. That would be pretty cool. I could almost make it look like a like a tow vehicle. I don't know. Just a thought. Just things that run around inside my head, rambling around in there like a 
couple of ping pong balls in a in a kettle. Uh oh, Lucky's going crazy. She saw the dog up front come out to pee. Listen to her. Out from Western Rhode Island. Hope you're enjoying your day.